Well, it's that time of year again. I'm standing here in the H. Rob French Memorial Tabernacle where preparations are underway for our Singing Christmas Tree. It's an annual ministry event where we throw open our doors to the community and uh, lots of people come in and celebrate the birth of Jesus. They hear the gospel shared with them and our students have a vital role to play in that. Last year we had close to 9,000 people that attended over the course of four nights. This year we're expecting just as large if not larger crowds. That's in addition to the people who join us online. And in fact, we'd love to have you join us online. If uh, you're not within driving distance, you can stop it by uh, HopesoundBibleChurch.com, click on the live link, and you can enjoy the same Christmas tree as well. As you can see, there's some beautiful artistry that's been employed in the sets this year. It's quite a dramatic presentation. We'd love to have you join us. Number of other news items from our campus. Our missions majors just returned from Nicaragua. They were there with Eric and Hannah Coons, who are HIM missionaries, and uh, they did a number of things, uh, doing some maintenance work on churches and passing out lots of literature and conducting services, and it was an exciting time for them. I just talked to Joy Budensick, our chairperson, and she said the students still haven't fully come home yet because they're still so excited about what God did for them on the mission field. Uh, several other things that I want to mention, some of them along an academic line. Um, a number of years ago, we began participating in what's called the Florida Common Course Code. Now that sounds like a very technical name, but it's a very, very important program for our students. What it does is it places the seal of approval of the state of Florida on our courses, on a course-by-course -course basis, so that when our students go to transfer those to local and state universities, um, they have a much higher probability of transferring with the seal of approval. Um, and so we are greatly increasing the number of courses that we offer that are included in the Florida Common Course Code. That's a very, very exciting development. We're also uh, launching a new program next semester and it is called the Student Resource Center. This is an academic intervention program to help our students who may be struggling with academics to help them to excel. And uh, our new uh, registrar, Mr. Lucas Ryder, is doing a fantastic job and he's the one launching this and it's going to be a program throughout the week that helps to uh, provide them with uh, study skills and to provide them with some accountability. And I'm very excited. Um, we have some students that have a heart for God and a heart for ministry but maybe they uh, struggle a little bit academically and this is going to help them to uh, boost their performance in that regard. Don't forget we have some important events coming up. Uh, Seabreeze Camp Meeting takes place February uh, 5 through 15. That's been going on for well over 50 years and uh, we're excited about the lineup of speakers and singers that will be coming this year. If you can't come down and join us, and you should if you can, uh, it's a wonderful way to get out of the snowy north if you're up there somewhere and to come down to sunny Florida for a little over a week. Uh, but if you can't, if you can't come down, uh, join us online. Go to HopesoundBibleChurch.com once again, click on the live link and you can enjoy uh, Seabreeze Camp Meeting. Also, there's an important event that is uh, conducted in conjunction with Seabreeze Camp Meeting, and that is our annual homecoming, and that will be February 6 and 7. And this year, we are focusing on the classes of 1965, 75, 85, 95, 2005. And so if you fall into one of those categories, we would love for you to come and enjoy memories shared from those classes. One of the most important things coming up is Welcome Week. That is February 25 through 27. That's when we invite uh, prospective students from all across the country to come to our campus, to stay in our dormitories, to sit in on classes, attend chapel, eat in the cafeteria, and mingle with our staff and students. It's just a wonderful, wonderful opportunity for students to listen for the voice of God and see if Hope Sound Bible College is the place for them. So mark those events on your calendar. We'd love to have you join us as always. Thank you for your support. God is doing some great things. You've been a part of that with your prayers and your contributions. I cannot tell you how much we appreciate that. Keep us in your prayers. We'd love for you to visit our campus and we'll try to keep you posted. Thank you for your support.